Tampa, uh, there has been some recent developments in Guyana as it relates to the election results. I mean, yes. The recount has been on, ongoing for quite some time, and it has uh, come to light that the PPPC has, in fact, uh, won overall. Do you wish to comment on that well, question? When I went to Guyana with CARICOM, I said it then and I've said it subsequently. And I said it in the presence of all our CARICOM leaders who went on that visit, and also with my friend um, David Granger, the president. And when we met Granger and Barrett, Dag Barrett Jack Deer together, and Jack Deer is also my friend, I said it then. An election stripped of all the regulations here and there. There are three, there are three separate, no connected elements to an election. What happens before the election day, that's process of registration, putting the machinery in place for elections, for free and fair elections. Secondly, what happens on election day? And there had been no complaints about those two processes. Nobody said it's a sham election or that irregularities or such as to undermine the efficacy of the poll. The third question which was outstanding is the counting of the votes. That's why in the first statement that Mia Motley made as Chair of CARICOM, she said that each vote must be counted. Each vote has to be counted. Well, this is where you had the basis for the recount. And the reason why it's an election and not a selection, you have to count the votes. And you have to count them honestly. Now, I am satisfied that CARICOM will not stand by idly and watch the recount which is properly done. For the results to be set aside. We expect the CARICOM observer mission to deliver its report and we expect that what is the recount would be honored and the Guyana Election Commission will honor that recount and declare the winner in accordance with this recount. And anybody who then wants to challenge anything afterwards can go to court. But you have to declare the winner in accordance with the recount. Um, St. Vincent and the Grenadines stands firmly for democracy and reflecting the will of the people. So that will tell you where we are. I don't have to say anything more. I am straight and plain. We, we, CARICOM is not going to tolerate anybody stealing any election. I know a lot of opposition parties when they win, when they lose, sorry. Or anybody who loses, they say, oh, so-and-so thief, so-and-so this. Now, it, it's almost a boring repetition. We get the reports, follow the law, and who wins, wins. When you take part in an election, there's always a chance that you may lose. And if you lose, as Sir Louis said, you take it looks like a man. 457-2705-516-350-9891. Uh, you can also send your WhatsApp messages to 457-2705 as well. Uh, those are the numbers by which you can reach out to us. I believe we have a first caller online. So we will take that call and we'll go to the WhatsApp immediately after. Good morning, caller. 